Good evening, everyone. Welcome to Zyka's Comeback. I have so much to catch up on because I also didn't realize that I'd missed two of their other songs from their Japanese album or releases in my last reaction because I have just not seen announcements. Like I, I say this in a lot of my reactions just so that you guys are aware. If I'm not tagged in something on Twitter, I don't see anything. Like I don't know because I don't like I don't just scroll on Twitter and that's where most things are announced. And like I don't I just don't see anything, you know, even like I don't scroll anywhere. Apart from TikTok. I think TikTok's the only place I scroll. So I miss announcements. I miss everything. And um, until they release things, I'm like, oh, sick. <laughs> so anyway, I'm here to do the full album plus the two songs I missed. Um, I felt like I needed a green juice because I'm going to need some help to get through this. So I am, I'm healthy, you know, in some form, but I may be in the grave at some point also, so you know, pray for me, pray for yourself. <laughs> Let us get straight into which their title track. <sighs> I don't know what the sound is going to be. So this is sick. <sighs> That's good boys. That was so sick. Ouija? 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 Like Ouija board? 
What is which in Korean? <clears throat> um, let's do a little swapsie. Swapsie. Go to Korean. Manyo. Interesting. Interesting. Um, that was so sick. Oh my gosh, that was so sick. And watch that again. I love like I I'm not actually a fan of um circus themes and those creepy clown kind of vibes. <clears throat> but I absolutely love this. Like anytime there's any kind of circusy feel like in a, in an instrument, I usually it creeps me out like and there's certain sounds when my brain just can't, like it makes me feel nauseous. This does not make me feel nauseous. I love the way they've used the instruments to create the vibe of that, but create such a dirty bass line throughout the whole song. There's so much that's in the, the instrumental. Um, I feel like Junmin was the main character throughout this whole thing and I wasn't actually reading the lyrics. So I'm going to go do another watch through and read the lyrics and just see if um, there's an explanation or if he's just the main character of the MV. Like, I don't know if he's portraying a character because I wasn't reading the lyrics. <laughs> Such a cool MV. Oh my gosh. He's got like a mission? Wait, what does that say? Do you want to make a bit a bet with me? Oh, do you want to make a bet with me? Oh, oh, I muted it. Oopsie daisy. Oh, he didn't, he didn't answer though. Love Hunter in this part, in the chorus as well. Wow, Jimmy sounds great too. Oh. He kills this part. Hunter has a lot of uh, killing parts, but this might be my favorite of his. There's something about the grittiness in his voice in this chorus. Oh, it sounds so good. Mm. The tone, my God. I don't know if they're depicting like so obviously they're in like uh, some kind of a I want to say you know like those horror houses where like everything's like a maze and like one wrong choice you'll end up at like a dead end or you might end up in the wrong kind of like I don't know being scared I don't know when I was younger there was this big horror house I don't remember what it was called um and you went in it and you had to choose like you had like six doors to choose from and each door would lead you to a different part of this like it was like in a theme park and I don't know if it was a movie world or I don't know I can't remember what it was dream I don't know anyway and you'd pick a door and then it was like a maze to something and like 
um, if you took the wrong way, you would get like scared by like the workers, but they were all dressed up and stuff. And so you had to try to pick the right direction and the right path to get out of the horror house. And that's what it's kind of reminding me of. But it's also like very um, relatable just to life. Like sometimes you have no idea what the right choice is and it could take you to the wrong path. But we're all just trying to find our way out of this well, way through life, really. It's all a maze. Every decision is going to lead you to something else. Um, and there's always going to be things that are trying to get in your way. So I don't know if it's kind of like, yeah, I don't know if that's what they're depicting, but that's kind of how I'm seeing it. Well, I love that little sound. Whoop, whoop. Sounds so good. Hey. I love this like passing of the ball rap back and forward between each uh, three of the rappers. It's really cool. Oh wow, and they don't even start on the same line. Like they don't even start on the new line. Da -da -da -da. They, they say like the first one or two words of the next line and then it continues into the next person. That's really cool. That's so cool. That's really creative. <laughs> So then are they, I'm confused, are they the, did we just do a little switch? Are they trying to get away from something and then, or trying to find their way out, but really they were the ones that were keeping us in? Um, wow. So has anyone got theories? I'm going to wait for Andy and Jazz because <laughs> they will explain it. Uichi, Uichi, oh, it's Uichi, which means location. I read it as Uiji, like a Ouija board. Oh my god, does that is that what location means? Uichi, is that how you pronounce it? Hang on. Oh, I didn't know that word. Uichi. Uichi. Ah. Oh. Interesting. But then. If, Uchi. but then, sorry, I'm thinking of Ouija, Ouija board, but like that kind of sounds the same and it kind of works because it's witch. I don't know. <clears throat> Maybe it's just because I'm not pronouncing right, but like it kind of fits in my eyes. <laughs> All right. Well, let me know your theories of the MV. Um, we're going to watch the performance spoiler. I want to see more of the choreography. I don't know if this is just going to be the MV. I'll watch it anyway, I guess. Oh, it's not. It is actually performance. Sounds so good here. Wow. 
Oh, this part is so good. Jimin's voice is so perfect for this part. Wow, the choreography is so good. Yeah, I absolutely love how um, hi higher pitch. He's got like a sweeter tone, the sweeter tone. Um, that's the word I was looking for. Junmin has. It sounds so beautiful. <clears throat> that's so good. I love it. I love it. <laughs> well, all right, let's get into the album. Um, so we don't have lyric videos yet because it's just come out like two hours ago. Um, so I'm sure they'll come, but, and I will go back. I won't do a react. Oh, shivers. Audacity quit unexpectedly. That's okay. We don't need audacity for what we're doing. Okay. Um, I'll go and read the lyric videos myself, but I won't do a reaction to them. Um, so we're going to start off with watch out. I'm just going to go down in order. This is probably going to have to be a two part reaction because sometimes when you react to, the, to so many things at once, it gets blocked. So I'll just do it in two parts just to be safe. Whoa, that's so scary. think of a more perfect intro song to this album that it that just perfectly encapsulates the vibe of what I heard from which um, <clears throat> and I'm just realizing location also if you just take get rid of the I which it also sounds out which it just that it has the which at the end sorry it just maybe I just thought about that. So there's so many different ways. Anyway, <laughs> um, perfectly encapsulates what I heard from Witch. So obviously setting the scene, setting the vibe for the whole album. So I wonder if it will all be like that. Let's go back off. I need some, I need some nutrients, guys. Get your nutrients in. Hey. Sour. Very hip hop. I don't wanna run around now. Do you know that I'm trying to get in the gutter? Double down, I'm gonna put it up to now. Think I'm not jumping better. It's good, it doesn't matter. Would you don't like it? I'm not getting it. Don't get it. I never did on that. I did on that. I'm gonna take a picture. Think I'm gonna meet a girl and then get us into a trigger. Let's just start now. We can't stop in two months. Let's go. This is rappers. This. Hey. this reminds me of something that they have. Go 
my phone. <laughs> Going off, Oh, I love that part. I see that you're terrified. How good is this beat though? Interesting. I absolutely love this, but for some reason I thought that it would be very similar to like I didn't know if the whole album was gonna have that like that like circusy vibe, but it doesn't. It's very hip hop. We don't stop. That's what I was thinking. Oh my god. You know when you're listening to one song and you know something sounds like something, but you can't figure it out because you're already listening to a different melody? Hmm. It sounds like we don't stop. Like just, um, I think that maybe the BPM is the same, and um, Minjae's delivery of the rap. We don't stop, baby brother. Yes, I love a good rap song because you need to showcase how good these rappers are, and obviously the vocalist did a great job too. But the obviously the, it was a rap heavy song. All right, this is a bitter sweet. Thinking, to be honest, this group does the the rappers in this group are actually really, really, really highlighted. I was just thinking, like as I was listening to this, in every song they've had, the rappers have had quite a lot of parts, haven't they? I feel like their style is like Zach is like music, apart from obviously some of their soul songs, is kind of rap heavy. Sorry, I just realized it's like vocals too, but like the rappers aren't falling short of lines. I like hectic rap parts. Oh, this is nice. Now it's kind of incorporating that circusy vibe. With that melody. Loving that guitar.
Melody Fall. Whatever it is. is really cool you know it kind of like gives me like a greatest showman kind of vibe you know this is the greatest show it has that kind of a really grand really like um um kind of like belty like everyone everyone come together <laughs> you know what i mean the guitar the guitar mixed with their vocals and certain instruments that they used as I was, when I said that melody fall down, it was like the, I don't know how to explain it, but it kind of like the way that whoever it was sung the melody and the way the melody kind of fell gave it that creepy kind of feel to it. But then the guitar coming through was so grand. So I, I loved the instrumental in that one. That was really cool. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. I'm going to end this. And I'm going to film straight away to do the last four. So we still have Sandcastle, Hang Around, Are You Serious and Cool. So um, please leave me a comment um, and let me know what your favorite is out of the album so far. Or maybe your favorite out of just what we've listened to. Uh, give me your thoughts on the MV um, and then please come over to the part two. That will be up straight after this. So um, I'll upload uh, I'll, I will upload it straight away. I will see you guys in just a second. Bye bye.